Hello. Hello, hello, hello. I'm getting the uh the captions up for you guys right now. Don't you worry. There we go. Tee hee. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, here. What because I was not Steel, you are first. Hello. There you go. There's your little first message I do. <laughs> uh Kagamine, hello, hello, hello. Echo, hi, hey uh uh JBZ. Uh da 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 sheep, hello, 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 shockwave, hi, hi, heroes, ah, Hello. I'm first in Spirit Ranch. Hi. My game is doing reset things. Ow. Sea Blast! Hello. Thank you for the Hydrate Ranch. Well, well, well. I've been good. Uh, Z Blast, I don't know if you've popped around recently. Um, but we now do ASMR and, and stuff as well. I, I still stream games during the day. I, that's true. I do. I do. I do. But uh, at night, I do ASMR. And it's, it's nice and comfy and cozy. Steel, it's like 93 degrees. It's hot. Weather, just be weather and stuff. Oh, guys, oh my god, hold on. He <laughs> he. It's literally the exact same code, but you know me, I gotta, I gotta post it. I gotta post it and pin it. We don't have any new codes, but still, it's there. It's there in chat for you guys. Tee hee. Oh, and then we go over long, here. Long time on this. Um, I'm gonna get the music pull up here in a second. But come on, guys, you know me. You know me. Oh my god, did the bot ever post my live? Nah. It's not a Wuwa fan. Alright. I'ma do that. Guys, don't be mad at me. Don't be mad at me. Oh. 
Okay, you know what this means? We are pulling. We're pulling, guys. We're pulling. Oh my god, String Master? Well, I mean, while I'm here, I might as well, you know, test the waters. Okay. <laughs> We are 100% going to do a 10 pull right now. Whether you need help with working out or maintaining your health, feel free to come by my gym. We How many times am I going to get you? I don't <laughs> Give me mommy. Give me mommy. Mommy, mommy. Greetings, Martha. I got so scared for a second. I got so scared for a second. I was like, that's not Yinlin. <laughs> Mommy, mommy, mommy. What's that look on your face? Yeah. Surprised to see me? Lit. Yeah. Yeah. I think I have some weapon banner pulls. Might as well just throw that in there. She came home, Poggies? Yes. I was not stressed about that at all. Cool. Uh, I might as well just throw in the extra one. Skip it. Because it's nothing. Well, uh, I am not a person that is going to continue to pull on her. Um, I'm not a person that's like, I need 20 of the same character. No, uh, I will... Probably... Or is this store? I might get more of those, but honestly... No, no, we'll, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We will see. Because, man, I love my Encore. I do, I do, in fact, love my Encore. And she's kind of like a sub-DPS. For, uh, Catchillo or whatever it is. <laughs> I don't know, I don't remember it. Oh, thank you, Dinobot. I really do appreciate it. Ow. Thank you, Palchito. I called him Calchuro. All right. Well, that was kind of like the the build up of the day. I'm really happy I got another one of you. I forgot your name. Sanhua. Not me gonna accidentally call her Sanhua. No. <laughs> Uh, I got another one to use. Mommy. Mommy. <laughs> Shockwave, thank you for the licky. 
Yinlin's banner weapon is super good on Encore, dead ass. I thought Cosmic Ripple was still like it. Indeed, dead of the asses. Oh. Yeah. For us I'm following. I really am. Are just the bare minimum. The key to success is having an unbreakable will. God. <laughs> Look at her. Okay, here. Uh let's open up the store. Um I can only get two. I don't know why I thought I had more pulls than that. Like currency. Ashtray. Not store again, convene. Thank you, thank you. History, not that. This history. I might as well. Single pull. Might as well single pull. Okay, you know, just cuz, just cuz, we're gonna, we're gonna throw her in. Who the fuck is she? <laughs> so we're teaming up. Fine. Uh. Zapstring, the stage is yours. Be gone. Okay, okay, here. Uh uh, there's event things that give me more free pool things. I, I just had to... I, I, I know I'm gonna play as her anyway here. But, uh... I... Are you done staring? No. <laughs> um, I just wanted to see her as, like, my character, you know? I... Operation. Hear the thunder. Time to wrap it up. Oh. <laughs> oh. Think you got My field of expertise. Back off. Oh, there's more. Okay, hold on. Pieces. Zap 
fuck, she's so hot. Huh. <laughs> okay, okay, here, let's let's get the poll going. Let's get the poll going for the music. There you go. You got three minutes. You can pick the 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 music we listened to today. Might as well do these as well while we're here. How reliable. your back attack is the best defense uh. how reliable swift and resolute from the shadows. uh yes that is still going on i don't know specifically what you get for it but i do know it is still going on <laughs> But vote, vote on the music. Credibility in the name and customer satisfaction is the game. Oh shit! Heroes, thank you for the tier one and gifted sub to Soxy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oops. too distracted <laughs> heroes thank you thank you thank you i don't know why it's not going aloft in like an alert thank you for the tier one gift it's up to z blast as well thank you thank you thank you Give me my free things. 
Yo, does that mean I have another character, like, not trial, but like, uh, guide, uh, training thing? I like doing them because it gives me free shit. I like free shit. Exactly, we love free shit. We love free shit. Okay, where even is that? <laughs> the character choice. It's in here. I just don't. Is it? Yeah. There's a new one. There was only two. What's the other one? Is that like for the echoes? That's new. Oh shit, the music. Lo-fi. <laughs> no mercy. Crush them. Oh, oops. What do you- I just did that. I pressed E. Watch and learn. Free the Lord. Nightmare! I am not cringe. Thank you for the tier 3 for 17 months, Nightmare. Thank you, thank you, thank you! Thank you. Also, we're about to start a hype train, guys. We have a minute. What the fuck? Okay, bye. Get me out of here. If anyone has a hundred bits, that's true. If anyone just wants to casually drop a hundred bits, I think that should start the hype train. <laughs> Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> it's gone now. That's okay.
No rush. The impatient ones will fall right into our lap. Nah, that's fake. They should have made her her thing purple. They they should have made her thing purple. Don't care. Thank you for the lurky Kiros. I too need food. I was just gonna get food after stream and maybe delay ASMR because it's just easier that way. Yo! Let me run. Oh. Oh. Hey, I already messed up my, my, my groove. Oh, the game really called me dumb. No. Good. There's no time to waste. I pulled out my glider. Okay, where am I going? Who am I talking to? I'm supposed to talk to somebody. Did I do it already? Did I accidentally do it already? Oh, shoot. I knew that. Okay. Uh... Time for more pulls, I guess. Maybe. I don't know. No, I don't even have enough. Whatever. It's okay. Here, um, let's, uh, let's level up my Yinlin more. I don't have her leveled up yet, like, fully. Where's this? A mecha bomb? Oh, you, you're the mech? That's rough. Okay, whatever. I don't like fighting the mech. I don't like this man, okay? He killed me. I was not expecting it the first time I fought him. Ugh! Sorry, I love her so much! Okay, you guys are Oh, I know. I, I, I plan I plan to change off my inland. Trust me. She's she's not really my main what kind of story will No. 
There we go. <laughs> um though i do know i'm very much broke i do not have the havoc rover yet um but if i were to use yinlin i don't have calcharo Honestly, it doesn't take too long. I know, I just haven't gone through the story. I did not want to do this. I'm trying to press Q. Let me press Q. No, I held it. Fuck. I'm throwing. I'm throwing. I'm throwing. I need two of these, too. Uh, uh. Oh, trophies? Why am I getting a trophy? Oh, absorbed 100 echoes. Damn. The Fedora Punji guy actually works pretty well. Really? Uh, I mean, okay. I, I know I need to go get my Havoc Rover. Uh, you just do the story, right? That's all you do? You just do story? Yeah. Listen, I didn't know if it was like story and then there's like side story. But I know I do want to level up my Yinlin regardless. Uh, because I try not to talk too much about spoilers, Havoc Rover is kind of just something we all kind of know of, in a way. Um, I'm, I'm at the point where people get arrested, Soxy. That is all I will say. Because this game still is fairly new. Bro, can this man just spawn again, please? Come, come on. Give me your health bar. Give, give me... There we go. Brother. Oh shit. Well, might as well do this.
Yeah, I don't... I haven't finished the story, so I don't... I don't know where that is in this story. I just know it happens, and I'm there. So... I'm starting chapter one. Ah! Okay, let's ascend you. That did make me stronger. Yeah, it Should did. I'm thinking about how to repay you. Okay. Man, I don't... I don't know. Ooh. I know this is better. Not this. This. I know this is better. So I'll switch you over to that. It's it's not the best, I don't think, but it's better. And that's all that matters. What? Uh okay. We no, I didn't want to purchase levels. I just wanted to claim. I'm sorry, I clicked the big button in front of me. Uh, okay, I guess we do story. I guess that's what we do. I guess we just go and do story. I know like I, I feel like with how much I play the game which isn't really at all um my union level really is not that bad trust me I I, I plan to cap that shit out but like I'm I'm union 28 like I don't Oh, trust me, I would love to sit down and just stream this, like, all day. Oh, hello! Qixia, Yang Yang, what brought you here? Oh, here, hey, I keep... Hey, Lin, we're here for some stories today, and here's our new friend. Ta-da! We've got the ultimate badass here, the one who can crush TDs, cook up Echoes, knock Inferno Rider flat, and KO Falian Baringle with a single punch. The legendary Rover! Hello! <laughs> so you are the famous Rover. Oh, youngsters these days are really something. Grandma Lin, since you're the flower expert, I got a favor to ask. Oh, yeah. Oh, the Blake Blooms. I remember. Have you seen flowers like this one before? Hmm. I'm familiar with most of the flowers local to Jinjo, but this one... Oh, it doesn't match anything we have here. I don't think I've seen anything similar. Not even in the plant encyclopedias. Oh no, if not even a flower expert like you can recognize it, who else could help us? Oh, Chisha, I'm far from an expert. We've got a plant-type resonator here in Jinjo, remember? She knows the plants much better than me. Oh, 
Are you talking about that young lady? I always see her helping out at your store. Yes, she has been a great help. She knows a lot about everything plant related. Is this Verena? Such a sweet child. Yes, this is Verena. Smiles always make me happy. She reminds me of the lovely star flowers. I'd call out to her, little star flower, it's dinner time. And she'd always answer with her brightest smile. What a lovely girl. Where can we find her? She's probably up in the back mountain doing some field research. I said I wanted a field in the back mountain to plant my flowers, and she offered to help right away. That's where she is now, checking it out. Go in that direction, and soon you'll see a waterfall. Walk right through the waterfall, then you'll reach the back mountain. Thank you so much, Grandma Lynn. Okay, oh, I... Any time, dearie. Don't forget to visit my Penjing shop. I'll have treats ready for you. Blessed. So where am I? How far away am I? Once we cross the waterfall, we'll reach Mount Pingting. Oh, ha, 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 ha. The flowers seem to be showing us the way. Let's follow it. flowers <laughs> that's impressive i didn't need it but like thank you all <laughs> look at her she's so cute Are you Verena? Yes, sorry. I should have introduced myself first. I know it's a polite thing to do in Huanlong. It is. It is a delight to make your acquaintance. I am Verena. My pressure to have the opportunity to meet with you today. What's the waveform tattoo on her chest? I don't fully know yet. I believe that's a part of the story and what we're going to figure out with time. I do know that's like something that signifies power like our 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 power and like abilities i don't know much more than that but everyone here has one in this frame uh rover has one on her hand yeah that's kind of the thing about this game is that it, everything's made up of like waveforms and stuff i don't fully understand to be honest it's i'm i'm, I'm still learning <laughs> my apologies i used to live in the new family. yeah a resonator so very familiar with the etiquette here hi varina i'm tisha this is yang yang and she's rover Grandma Lin told us we should come find you. Oh, right. Grandma Lin talked about you. I left those flowers so she knows how to reach me. What seems to be the trouble? If there's anything I can help you with. We're looking for a special flower. Hmm, it 
It's an unusual flower indeed. Pure black flowers are rarely found in nature. We can't rule out the possibility that it's been dyed. When looking at the Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Types of flowers that seem similar. Take iris for example. Its petals are similarly oval shaped, but it has double petals. And it's not viola either. Since viola has notched petals. Then there is also the cliff recluse, but this flower has a longer stamen and an extra petal. <laughs> Lemongrass is also similar in shape. It's native to the New Federation, and Huanlong people may not be familiar with it. Though it has a similar stamen length, it has a conical inflorescence with a trumpet-shaped corolla. Oh, and I almost forgot the peacock flower. It's a single petal flower with a similar stamen length, but... The peacock flower has a distinct peduncle, while this I don't know what a peduncle oh, is. You really know your stuff. I learned a lot from that. Anyway, this black flower does look very special. There are hardly any similar plants in nature, so I'm thinking it might be a newly cultivated species. Also, its veins are somehow cross-shaped. I can feel some faint traces of frequency fluctuations on it, too. It's a sign of overflowing remnant energy. So, my guess is it should be a unique remnant plant, created by a certain type of resonance energy. But in order to figure out the right soil for it, or exactly what type of resonance energy it is, I need more than just a picture. Gosh, help us out, someone! We don't know what kind of flower it is, and we haven't seen anyone wearing it either. Speaking of that, how does it even work? <laughs> if I wore this flower on me right now, do I automatically become one of them? Shizia, wait, what did you just say? Uh, yeah, I was just saying, if I wore this flower, would they immediately see me as one of their own? If this black flower is indeed their symbol, the Blackshore members should immediately notice it on you, but to everyone else, it would just look like a peculiar flower. Given that, if they are indeed in Jinjo City, we may only need to wear this flower to lure them out. Yeah, oh, you I need see. to get the flower. But how do we get our hands Yeah, on yeah. make one for you with my resonance ability if you just need something that looks similar let's go Verena hard carry come on Verena you can do it no way that's amazing seriously it looks exactly like the flower in that picture it's thank you it's nothing i'm glad i could help it's freaking amazing could you do that again please i love it <laughs> that's so cute oh girl 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 Girl, thank you, thank you, thank you for the raid. Hold on, I'm getting you shout out. I'm getting you shout outs. Not shield. Huge burning, burning, burning. There we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Girl! Everyone, everyone, please go follow Curl right now. They, she, she plays, she plays lots of Overwatch and stuffs, and I, I love her. She, she's my wifey. Please go give her a follow. Curl, welcome on in. I'm playing the Withering of the Waves. I know it is way different than Overwatch, so I'm sorry. Uh, I love you too, wifey. Everyone, please go follow Kuro. Thank you so much for sharing your amazing, lovely community with mine. Uh, everyone coming in. Hello, hello, hello. I'm Barry. I am a vegan vampire VTuber. 
I, I only drink blood consensually, so you have nothing to worry about. I am a super duper variety streamer. I I do Overwatch, Fortnite, Honkai Star Rail, Withering Waves. Sometimes I'll do MMOs. I really just play whatever. I do horror games. I do ASMR at night as well if you are into ASMR. Uh, I am currently going through the story, might I also say. So if you don't want spoilers, it probably would be best to go. Um, cause I, yeah, I, I'm, I'm just warning you guys about that. I am doing the active story. I know a lot of people have already seen it and finished it. Uh, but Kuro, especially you, as well as anyone else coming from the raid, please go get that self-care in. Go pee, go pee-pee-poo-poo, -poo. go go drink some water, eat some food, take a nice relaxing shower, go get good eepy sleepies, do whatever you got to do. I stream every single day, so it's okay. But I do appreciate the raid. Thank you, thank you. I love Wuwa. I'm addicted. Rover, have you noticed? We've been seeing these black petals for a while now. They're scattered all over the place. I'm pretty sure they're not made by Ms. Verena. The streams have been disrupted. Someone has been following us. Leave it to While me. I'm here, I might as well, you know. Luck! Luck, thank you for the tier one. Shelby for 13 months. That is a year and a month right there. Rover, are you sure you want us to leave? It could be dangerous for you. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Okay. I got a hand demon. Trisia and I will wear these black flowers and go look for members of the black shores in the city. Rover, please be careful. Ring us anytime when you need help. I know you've been here longer than the sub. I'm just saying, like, you've subbed for a year and a month. The and that's huge. What are they doing in a place like this? Oh. oh. Coming after me. That's huge. We love that bum boy. If I climb up to that point, I should be able to get behind that person. Oh, there was there was more grab full things. Oh, oh, this is where. Oh, I don't like sharing. Looking for me? Oh, here you are. <laughs> Look at them. She just ah! she the 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 whole yeah this hot hot. <laughs> You're 
You're such a box full of surprises. Who are you? I know. Like, it's... Ah. Why are you following me? So we're playing truth or dare now. I see. Oops. <laughs> Getting angry, are we? Sorry, but it's just so much fun to rile you up. You're the very first person to pique my interest like this. You have great potential. Ah. Oh. Answer my question. Okay, so you're not up for small talk. I'll keep that in mind. You're my mission target after all. Are you from the Black Shores? Bingo. I'm one of the bloom bearers of the Black Shores. This Blake Bloom is our symbol. It represents our mission to save the world. That's what it says in the rules, at least. Oh, shoot, ads. I'm so sorry. What are you planning to do with me? Our plans? Hmm. What is it again? Oh, to recruit as many talents as we can and save the world from its impending doom. So are you in? Yes. You don't sound like you want to save the world. Nuh uh, I don't. The world? Couldn't care less. If it's all going boom tomorrow, why not have fun while we can? To stop it, nothing for more power. Take down any prey without mercy and indulge in all our desires for the ultimate pleasure. How are you any different from the Fraxidus then? Well, I mean, I'd love to live that way. But alas, duty calls. The Black Shores, our garden, is home to many green fruits, and we'll make you the most special seed among them all. My duty is to nurture and safeguard seeds like you, allowing them to blossom into luscious fruits. Then, once the fruit ripens, I'll get to pick it and indulge the sweetness of my labor all by myself. A fruit. <laughs> You're just like what civilization simulation sand table Tethys has told us. I can feel such explosive potential within you. One day, you'll surely bear the most beautiful <laughs> Listen here. So on edge. Their 100% oh, is strange. explosive potential in me. Okay. <laughs> We can get out of this, like, position now. Actually, I've been diligently protecting you, you know. I got rid of all types of pests that tried to get in your way. Hey! Don't mention me and the Fraxidus in the same sentence. I couldn't care less about their petty games. But if they even think of laying their dirty fingers on you... <laughs> You're mine, and I don't like sharing. Just a couple ah! tricks, and I had those fools flapping around like headless chickens. What a boring crowd. Tricks? Whoa, don't tell me you haven't noticed. Enjoyed your nightly rendezvous with that long maiden. You have me to thank for keeping those Fraxidus people away. Well... I've answered plenty of questions already. Now it's your turn. Oh, see, now we're getting kinky. <laughs> Even more so. Okay. What do you want to ask? <laughs> Nothing in particular. The way you look at me, though, it's almost as if... No... Forget about it. But I'll be watching you. You're a very special seed. That I'm very sure. I can feel something oddly familiar about you. My name is Camellia. 
Try not to let me catch you so easily next time. And she's gone. Hm. That was fast. What took you so long to answer? Did something happen? Bro, have you been calling me this whole time? Yang Yang, I know we have this weird romance thing going on. I'm not interested, okay? Like, flower bitch and scar. Kinda. That's my tie. <laughs> Another stalker showed up. She's from the Black Shores. The Black Shores? Did she tell you anything? A shame I let her get away. At least you're safe. Shizia noticed a guy acting suspicious. I think she's keeping an eye on him. I'll be there soon. Sure. We are in the shopping district. See you then. Oh my god, look at the two kitties. I'm lonely, but like, I'll jump in. Ah. I need, I need to find someone who will like... Jump into the heart pond with me. <laughs> I need to take that off, please. That achievement real? I think it is. I don't know. I just saw it and I believe it. I believe that being an achievement. I don't know how that would work, but I do think I do think it's an achievement. I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> Did they take the bait? We walked the streets, wearing the Blake Bloom like you said. Talked to various people, but I didn't hear anything useful. What did you talk about? Nothing in particular. Just some small talk. Hey, aren't you the girl from earlier? Yeah! You're so pretty! Can I take another selfie with you? The one we did earlier looked a bit blurry. Oh, I see. Please stop teasing me. Shinsia did say she found someone suspicious. Look, it's him. Fucking all over. Perfect timing. This guy's been sniffing around here for a while now. He keeps trying to talk to the elderly and minors. I've been keeping an eye on him. And I saw a little girl with him. She kept turning her head and looking around, but now she's nowhere to be found. This is super fishy. Hey, I'm Patrol Achisha. Sir, business license, please. But business license? Uh-oh. I'm Alto, just a humble information broker. I've been traveling around, helping people out in my own small way. I see. Yeah, yeah. No license. I bet you don't have a fixed business location either, huh? Business location? Why would I need that? Hmm. Now show me your organizational accreditation, please. Well, I'm an honest broker of information, always open to negotiations at the right price. I'm the all-time Intel champ, with more best-seller certificates than I can count. No license? No clear business plan? You're running an illegal business. Then... Um... Who's your supervisor? You should at least have their ID number. M my supervisor? Oh, <laughs> right. She's like a super big deal. She's an ancient being, born with this planet we're living on. She's a will of a star. 
the reverberation of everything in this world. Are you for real? So do you even have a supervisor or not? Did she just ask to talk to his <laughs> manager? On. Yeah. I already told you about her. Why won't you believe me? Yeah, yeah, I believe you. I know what's going on. Now, sir, you're coming with me to the patroller station. <laughs> Bye. Please, <laughs> I didn't do anything illegal. I was just looking for someone. A little girl. Um, about this tall? She's the kind of stand out in any crowd. You really think I'm gonna buy that? Oh, you know, you saw her earlier. It's that girl. A pink haired girl? Yeah, exactly. Wait, how do you know? Because I love Encore. They would be besties. Secrets, and he loves pulling pranks on us kids, but he's not a bad guy, really. Ah, uh, Encore! Remember our little chat? What did I say about calling me Uncle in public again? I am not that old. That doesn't add up with what you just said. mushroom I managed to the antidote in time imagine what would have happened if I wasn't there don't worry Uncle's had plenty of that mushroom already but why did you go to such a dangerous place alone little Uncle? your back little one no worries just tell us what you know because because encore must keep an eye on her <laughs> uh, kids could have such wild imagination sometimes <laughs> hey alto didn't you just send encore there wait why are they all giving you the side-eye? Encore! Some things are better left unspoken, you know. Since the situation has come to this, I've got no choice but to tell you. Indeed! We're here for business, and it's a crucial one. You want to know what it is? Let's go, Encore! Hey! Alto! Wait for me! See ya! We still have a world to save! <coughs> Wait! <coughs> we can't let him get away! I I'll go search in the residential area. Here, here, I'll make it very fit. <laughs> Us. I'll go down 
that way towards the patrol station. I know the streets here like the back of my hand. Here's another split in the road. I'll go look for him in the square. I'll leave the other side to you. He's Naruto running to mock us. The gaps between each missed figure are shrinking. Over there, at the end of that alley. Huh. Now you're here. We have nowhere to run. We weren't really running from you. We just wanted to make sure you were alone. Be good, please. Encore and Uncle Alto won't do anything bad to you. She just called you an uncle again. That's enough, Encore. You're freaking our precious client out. Encore just did as Alto said. Encore is usually a good girl. Don't be scared, Rover. We just have a few questions for you. Was it your idea to have those two ladies wear those counterfeit Blake Blooms and attract our attention? I must admit, they looked quite convincing. If I was an outsider, I might mistake them for the real deal. So, you worked with a plant type resonator. Interesting. A plant type resonator. We happen to know someone like that too, don't we? Yeah, there are more than one of them out there. Not a big deal. So please, tell us, what do you want from the Black Shores? I want to join you guys. My past might be related to the Black Shores. Oh, really? So that lead about you is right indeed. Like what they say here in Huang Long, the straight hook is for willing fish to bite. Da -da -da -da. Your efforts finally caught our attention. Surprise! The people you've been looking for are right in front of you. Now, How's that for a piece of intel? I'll let you have it, free of charge. You're both from the Black Shores? <laughs> oh, Prophet, thank you for the hydrate. Look. Are we not I don't know why it's not... I know you must have a ton of questions for me, but one moment, please. As you already know... Did I get hit? Information broker. That means I make deals instead of passing out freebies. You want information from me? You gotta give me something in return. <laughs> Relax, Rover. We just want to make a deal with you. We want you to come with us to an abandoned Court of Savante facility to help us recover a resonance beacon. Okay. In turn, I'll tell you everything we know so far. Why should I trust you? Our business is centered around customer satisfaction and built on integrity. Otherwise, I did, I did. We wouldn't qualify as consultants of the Black Shores. And since you're a first time customer, I'm pleased to offer you an additional gift. Here, have this. This should prove you're serious, since you already know what it represents. If you still have doubts about us, just show it to that plant-savvy young miss. She'll be able to tell. Finally, as a last resort. Encore! Do your cute face! Quick! What a dirty move. <laughs> Please help us! Please! Look at this 
Poor child, pleading to you like that. How could anyone have the heart to do I can't. I, 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 I love her. Speaking and whining, Ix is Meyer. And don't forget to come alone, okay? Oh, encore. Rover, did you find them? Yes, they're from the Black Shores. What? Seriously? No way. They gave me this Blake Bloom. As I expected. This flower is indeed a type of remnant plant. And it contains a very unique kind of remnant energy. The concentration is much higher than usual, too. No way. Are they really from the Black Shores? Yeah. Not as mysterious as people make him out to be. Well, at least they're good at running. I'll give them that. What did they tell you? I made a deal with them. I would not be telling these people this. That place. I only heard it's an abandoned research institution. There is nothing special about it. Because of the dangerous weather conditions and whining Ix's mire, it's been ages since anyone went there. Don't worry, Yang Yang. We all know how strong our rover is. Okay, rover, I'll tell the academy about this. No! Transmit your data from the resonance nexus. Then, that beacon in the whining Ix's mire should be unlocked for you. There have been frequent tacit field activities recently. If you're going there alone, Please be careful. Just ring us whenever you need a hand. We'll come rushing. No, man. Ah. Damn. Okay, here we go. All the way over here. Well, awkward. Hi. I've sent the coordinates of that CSC research facility to your terminal. Now that we're in the same boat, let me fill you in on what we're getting into before we dive in. Okay. The Corda Sabante is a mysterious scientific research organization. They are best known for their research in automata mechanics. But what really put them on the map isn't that. It's all the bizarre experiments they did. What's with the psychedelic black light coming from Morning Ix's mire? And is that freaky ring in the waters really the lake monster's doing? One day, a daring young scientist soared Alto. into the sky and never returned. Could this be the beginning of another diabolical plot? Alto, why are you telling bedtime stories now? Is it time to sleep already? And then what happened? I want more. My bad. Old habits die hard. But a big part is coming right up. One day, out of the blue, every single Corda Savante member vanished. The last words from that mysterious researcher, the Corda Savante Committee's chairman, was this. Ahem. You want my research? You can have it! I left everything I gathered in the Corda Savantes labs. Now, you'll just have to find it. What do you think, Rover? Aren't you curious? Enough of this, let's go. <laughs> I knew you'd be into this like I am. But stories aside, we do have an important mission on our hands. I suppose the Magistrate Jinjo has already told you what we do? We've set up resonance beacons worldwide to monitor the lament, collecting data in real time. 
This is how he predicts when the next lament is happening. As the saying goes, one miss is as good as a mile. Every single one of those resonance beacons is crucial. Yes. After the Corte Savante researchers disappeared, all of our resonance beacons near their facilities were damaged to varying degrees. Recently, something went wrong with our lament detection system, and we suspected it had something to do with a damaged beacon around the area. That's why we've been sent here to investigate the case. While our main goal is to retrieve the lost resonance beacons, we also might find some treasures. Alto, even Encore can tell what you're up to. <laughs> it's called seize the opportunity while I can. <laughs> you're just too young to get it. Come on, let's go. Soxy, that is one thing I I can say that. It doesn't make me iffy on the game. It's just kind of like upsetting. And like maybe it's because I'm coming from the luxury of like Mihoyo. But man, you know, at least with the like English like voice acting, it's so inconsistent. Like Alto so fucking good and then you have yang yang and i think huh. you know like i how come it didn't warn us so many tasks of discords are they all just appeared out of nowhere that's weird like like i don't mean to like shit talk anyone you know like i am in no way a voice actor Chat, is this real? Yes. Hello, Nate. Wait, fuck. Hold on. Nate, stay. This is the place. Ugh. Those savants really love their puzzles. <laughs> no wonder folks never managed to get inside after all these years. Their security is top notch. That's because Alto set off the security alarm, and now the gate's closed. <laughs> anyway, we've got to figure out how to open it up again. God, Encore is so cute. Anyway, Nate, Nate, Nate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't be hating on Yinlin. Look at her. Oh, she's so hot. Salgo, thank you for the follow. You are now a baby bat. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome on in. Summer Game Fest is starting soon? What's Summer Game Fest? Bye-bye. 
Hey, Nate. This is... Oh, no wonder. Game news event? Oh, I don't really care. Crazy savants. They were trying to recreate the retroact rain. Never thought they could pull off something like this. Incredible. What on earth is the retroact rain? Is that when the rain floats up? The retroact rain is essentially a form of condensed remnant energy from the etheric sea. Various events across space and time from every dimension Sorry. are recorded in the form of remnant energy. The retroact rain conjures illusions of past events for those exposed to it. That rain curtain we saw earlier was probably the result of their experiments. Before the retroact rain forms, it goes through three stages. In the first stage, it looks just like any regular rain. And what we're seeing now should be the second stage. Water droplets floating in midair, being absolutely still. And I've then the third stage the is on the retroact rain. It going up instead of down. Most of the researchers were driven by their obsessions, while some wanted to relive a particular experience, and others yearn to reunite with their loved ones. But <laughs> look at all these devices here. The sheer scale of this research is really something. It really makes one wonder. What on earth were they trying to bring back of such a massive retroact rain? The power system know. here might still work. Let's split up and find it. Hey! Willie's right away! That Fraxidus Overseer has been really generous with his sponsorship. It would have taken us much longer to build this place without him. Though he loves to meddle with our experiments a bit too much. Well, he's our patron. Can't do anything about that. Francie, hello, thank you for the follow. You are not the baby bat. Welcome on in. Hello, hello, hello. Okay with it, as long as we can keep doing our research. Hi, welcome yeah. back, Karumi. Where else could us maniacs possibly go? The committee kicked us out like trash. They'll never understand. As Professor Heisen stated, we are embarking on a monumental endeavor with the power to redefine humanity's future. This time, we will make the divine miracle we saw happen again for all of humanity to behold. The experiments have been going smoothly, but we still can't get the desired outcome. Why? The artificial retroactive rain project has advanced to its second phase. We have Thank you for the head pat. Sorry, I'm I'm invested. <laughs> was the whining Aix's Maya at some point. Now, we believed we could recreate that divine miracle with the artificial retroactive rain. Have we been mistaken? We have no time left. The artificial controllable tacit field should be complete by now. We'll have to rely on our backup plan. Oh, I didn't even have... Oh, I did. Oh, I...
Knowledge is power. Uh, down here? Not in. Back up we go. Grab one from the... Oh. There's nothing to grab in here. Whatever's. What the? I can't get that one. I'm so smart. Why are we flicking me? Are my are they working? Oh, oopsie, silly me. I didn't even have the green one in. I'm so yeah. silly, goofy. Ah! This is the last of Thank you for the stretch. Okay, I stretch. I stretch. Before puzzle. Pulled for Yin one or not? I got her uh, 60 pulls. Roughly. It it could it could have been less. I just I just know I pulled 60 times and I got her on that last 10 pull. I will, I will showcase. In a bit. It's getting closer. Oh, hold on. Cutscene. my final words. <laughs> if only I had more. I thought my enemies were misconceptions, waning passion, and my own ignorance. Only in the end did I realize time is my ultimate foe. Yeah, I don't have enough of it in a day. I became blindsided by my fear of death and insatiable thirst for truth, eventually derailing our research. Uh, I am. I'm pulling for String Master. I'm like 14 pulls in. It was too late when I finally came back to my senses. We, we had already walked into that false gate. 
Cosmic Ripples isn't bad. If you want better, get String Master. Now, I'm leaving my last realization. If you're here. building that for Yinlin, especially. They are our past, but they are also our future. Had I realized it sooner, there might have been a chance to get things back on track. The future being hailing from our past. Please save us once again. Yeah, no, Cosmic Ripple still isn't bad. I don't have it. Keep pushing forward. <laughs> I have like augmentation. Real gate that can change the world. It's bow. It's bow. Isn't that also like the the space mommy that like held my hand? Rover, about this person. I think I know her. <laughs> <laughs> Knew it. Great. Now that power has been restored, the elevator should work. The beacon signal is coming from below. Let's go. Let me take the elevator. Oh, out. Out the door. Out the door, Barry. Wee. I just jump in the ceiling hole. I just fought this man. Wow! A big clunky monster. Damn. Those Damn. Never run out of new surprises for us. The signal's coming from it. Did it swallow our resonance beacon? Peace is an option. Guys, brace yourself. We'll need to take it down. Alto, we doing it like we usually do? Of course. <laughs> then this big guy is Encore's to tackle. Cosmos, Cloudy, attack! Let me figure out its weakness. I like how it... I, it just... <laughs> I see. That was really smooth. I pressed... I'm pressing right click. I'm pressing right click. Brother. Listen up. Life is in everything. Watch out. I'm pressing right click. What do you want from me? Anyway. Job done. <laughs> is strong. Told ya. Encore is strong. I love my encore. Why did they keep that big guy here? 
According to our findings earlier, researchers who worked here were probably only a small faction of the Corda Savante Committee. They were likely studying an ancient civilization they deemed to be divine beings. But later got denounced from the CSC due to their extreme methods. Somehow, they believed this ancient civilization had once visited the mire, which led to their attempts at recreating those past events with artificial retroact rain. And when they failed to recreate the retroact rain, they resorted to making a replica of the lost civilization instead. To get their desired results faster, mm -hmm. they started feeding this replica various frequencies, data sets, and mechanical constructs. <laughs> and we've seen what that ended up with. It turned into a monster, driven by the frequencies of hunger, devouring everything in its path. It was probably the culprit behind the disappearance of those folks. And I suspect the Fraxidus Overseer mentioned in that log may have something to do with it all. Those researchers, they were too obsessed with validating the divine miracle they experienced. They eventually got lured into the monster's frequencies of hunger and willingly walked into its maw. The monster devoured them, but not with its teeth. Their own delusions and fear were their undoing. In Damn. The <laughs> what a crazy bunch. So, Rover, now it's time for me to fulfill my promise. What do you want to know about the Black Shores? I, that's all I really want to know is what is the relationship between me and the Black Shores. A significant consultant at the Black Shores. So I don't know that much about all its hidden secrets, but I believe the piece of intel I'm about to share with you will make this trip worth your effort. This is not the first time you've been reawakened. Last time, you woke up at the Black Shores. Rover, we share the same goal. We're both aiming to fight against the Thernodians and prevent the Lament Crisis. Yep! Onkar can prove it! The Thernodian is a bad, bad guy! And Onkar and Alto are the heroes of justice! So we're gonna stop the bad guys! I understand. Trust isn't something you could afford to give out that easily. Remember the Blake Bloom I gave you earlier? It's yeah. more than just a symbol. It also holds the key to our headquarters. I'm sure it'll come in handy for you. Phew! Anyway, mission accomplished! We've got the resonance beacon secured, plus a sweet bonus of Corda Savante's big secrets. Glad I got you on board, Rover. Looking forward to our future collaborations. Oops. Almost forgot. Gotta check the resonance beacon again. Just in case. Wait. This is... No. It can't be. Hey, Alto! Wait! One sheep, two sheep, three... Uh, where was I? Uh, up. I gotta go back up. Back up. Okay. Uncle 
or heard lightning. When there's lightning, it's gonna rain. And when it's gonna rain, Ankar should bring an umbrella. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Alto said when it rains like this, we hide. It's just ordinary rain, isn't it? I don't see the rain, so... No. This is... It's the real Retroact rain. Rover. Jinjo. Jinjo is under attack. It's a TD outbreak. Yang Yang, shut up. You're like the Paimon. This rain, it's finally happening. General, yes, how's it going? We have 500 remaining soldiers prepared and medically cleared for combat. After receiving the antidote for Retroact Rain, they have reported minimal hallucinations and no adverse effects. However, a few veterans still reported sporadic sightings of phantoms in the rain. I see. Stay alert. We will continue as planned. Report any signs of potential TD outbreaks immediately. We march on to the Norfall Barrens as soon as the rain stops. Aye, sir. Stronger emotional connection to the affected area leads to more intense hallucinations. That's what they said. I should go for another round of inspection. Make sure everything is going as planned. So, like, when do I get Havoc Rover? Blessed! I don't- I don't really care, I- There we go. General! Play. We've got all equipment <laughs> repaired. Attack type weapons adjusted and given to the resonators. Non resonators are also equipped and prepared for action. Yes. But the rain's getting heavier. Now oh, it's going upwards. One of our combat medics claims it's no ordinary downpour, and he strongly advises holding off any moves until it clears. Though young, his sharp intuition has been proven in previous battles. You've seen it first hand. However, I do agree this will be our last chance at organizing another attack. The medic you mentioned, what is his name? Sir, his Sir, name is... Name is name. Gianni. General, help, help, help. Please, help me. What do you make of this, Gian? Hey, it's Cheeto Man! Maybe you are right. The rain just happened out of nowhere. It's indeed unusual, but... This is our only chance. The 
enemy we've been yearning to destroy is finally right before us. And now, you're asking me to sit back and do nothing because of some phantoms. Stay silent. Silence? Is this your response? Or is it fear holding your tongue? Both. No. I see. You're no different. We fear, we bleed, we suffer, and in the end, we'll all die on the battlefield. Yeah. But what about your brethren, friends, and comrades, as you witness them viciously slain before your eyes, one by one? Will you still remain silent when their souls demand an answer? There is no other choice. We must trample the pile of corpses at our feet and push on. Keep barking orders. Keep fighting until every last one of those monsters is gone. The retroact rain merely creates illusions of past events. My soldiers will not succumb to those hallucinations. I will not allow it. That's not how that works. We'll crush anything in our path, no questions asked. And I will pave the way for us all with my forte. If tens, hundreds, thousands more of my men will die, so be it. We will win this battle by any means necessary. Like, maybe you shouldn't. John, I have a question for you. What would you have done on that day if you were in my position? Whatever you say, I'll never answer those brave souls with such silence and cowardice. Not really. I was kind of expecting this. It's Zhao, but bigger. Where? Oh. Break everybody. Hold on. I have to pee. What are those ads popping? They're popping soon. Okay, I can continue a little bit. Until the last of them is wiped out. General Gersh General Gershu Lin. We fight to protect what we cherish. And we cherish our comrades, not out of cowardice or fear, but out of trust. The trust in their lives' worth. I cannot assure you I am always making the right choice, General. Yo! We only need two more followers and then we're at 3.8. But we should never build our victory on top of endless sacrifices. 
Is that so? As I see it, you're cut from the same cloth, you and I. Perhaps we are indeed, General. I share at least one thing with you. I too will draw my blade to fight for what I believe in. And I'll stop at nothing to see it through. General. General, you look pale. I'm fine. Please go on. Okay. We're pausing this. The ads just popped. I'm gonna BRB. And I'm, I'm gonna use the bathroom. Enjoy enjoy some some lo-fi while I'm while I'm gone. I'll be right back. Mwah.
Boo. Okay, we continue. We just detected an intense frequency reaction from that tacit field ahead. That moon. It's gradually turning full now, as you predicted. The sky. It looks just like how it was during the battle beneath the crescent. It's time. Sir, the Midnight Rangers are ready. We await your orders. Attention all troops. Take position and get ready to engage. Sir. When the moon turns full, the roving traveler shall return. The prophecy is being fulfilled. Here they are. They're not coming at us. Are they trying to protect something, or are they waiting for commands? With a TD outbreak of this magnitude and organization, someone must be orchestrating it. Could it be? Who could it be? Man, I love her too. Is that crownless or whatever that echo's called? Listen, I whoop that. <laughs> I whoop the ass. I don't. It's no biggie. Solo that shit. <laughs> the moon. It's changing. Rain falling. Rover? Maybe this is the right time Madam Magistrate was talking about. Citizens of Jinjo, please remain calm and evacuate in an orderly manner as we practiced during previous drills. Didn't she? It's a pre recorded broadcast message. Our Magistrate saw this coming, and she had General Jian devise an emergency plan a long time ago. We knew this was coming, and we were ready, but oh boy, the amount of TDs is insane! Thanks for coming in time, Rover. It would have taken us much longer to handle this. Oh, Director Tao Chi is here too. For a better rundown of the situation, you can find her near the city gate. Heard, heard and understood. Damn, I'm sorry. Oh. Any update on the protective barrier? We've put in all our resources to repair it. But if those tacit discords keep coming at us, it might not hold up for long. Hi, Kiros, by the way. I, 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 I knew you were here. I presume you must be Rover. And you are? Hmm. Maybe we've met somewhere before. Anyway, please allow me to introduce myself. I am Tao Chi, a director at the Ministry of Development. I'm in charge of our defense fortifications. 
Thank you for lending us a hand. What is this barrier you were talking about? It's our defense system against the retroact rain. It does a good job of keeping the city safe from the rain's effects. Once the protective barrier breaks down, tacit discords could manifest from inside Jinjo City. How does the retroact rain cause TD outbreaks? Rover. Remember what I told you earlier? The retroact rain is essentially condensed droplets of remnant energy that fall from the etheric sea. This remnant energy makes it a magnet for tacit discords. But I came from up there. It records events from all times and places, allowing those who come in contact with it to witness illusions <laughs> of past events. That's what we call the phantoms of retroact rain. It kind of like, like how resonators space resonators mommy resonators like world. held my hand the more you're exposed to the rain the more realistic those phantoms become oh and here's another interesting fact about the retroact rain when it's raining across a large area illusions pulled from the memories of multiple people can manifest at once the thernodian war Nice catch, Rover. Jinjo has been a battleground for centuries. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's why it has to deal with the Thrinodian that represents a concept of war. And wars will lead to deaths. Once the Retroact Rain reaches its final stage, there will be thousands of phantoms. Phantoms of dead soldiers and tacit discords. This is the one major threat that has been looming over Jinjo. Our magistrate ordered the construction of this barrier precisely because of that. What's so big about these phantoms? Indeed, the phantoms should only mechanically repeat what they had been doing. They shouldn't have the ability to interfere with reality. But the retroact rain can be significantly enhanced through the Thernodian's power. As a result, said phantoms become increasingly realistic to the point of inflicting real harm on humans. In that battle three years ago, our soldiers got into a gruesome fight against countless tacit discords, either native to Northal Barrens or produced by retroact rain and endless swarms of phantoms. Phantoms of tacit discords and our fallen soldiers repeated their indiscriminate attacks on everything in their sight. Soldiers uh -huh. did not tell friends from foe. The relentless rain even recreated the brutal deaths of their comrades, etched in vivid detail. The Norfolk Barons turned into a living hell, and to this day, we can still hear the desperate cries. The battle beneath the crescent was humanity's first recorded encounter with retroact rain enhanced by Thrinodian power. Your previous general sent back valuable video recordings of the rain. Those videos provided crucial information, which allowed nations worldwide to speed up their research on defense against the retroact rain. Uh huh. Our people on the Black Shores have theorized that the Thrinodian abnormal moon sightings and the retroact rain may be linked. Which in turn reflects the Thrinodian strength? Yeah, something like that. But it's only a theory. We don't have enough data to verify anything. So, unfortunately, we can't predict retroact rains yet, but we know it's closely connected with Thernodian's reviving. The TD outbreaks are another sign. The moon uh -huh, just changed uh -huh. in an instant. If this theory this turns out to be like true, this doesn't look like the Sminty you promised. 
What do you mean? I haven't promised anything. Thank you for the hundred biddies, Nightmare. The Thernodian is ri reviving sooner. And Jinjo's dealing with what happened three years ago. We can get through this. The Thernodian's revival is never an independent occurrence. They could sense one another through some form of telepathic link. The revival of a Thernodian in Jinzhou will trigger catastrophic events and affect other nations. I'll eat it with my hand. Space, recalibrate our lament detector and warn them before it's too late. Anyway, we'll take our leave now. Please stay safe. We'll do encore. I will eat the Thernodian with my hand. That's all we've gathered so far, Rover. The TD outbreaks won't stop before the end of this rain. We must stay alert. Mom, there's another wave of them ahead. Ah, <sighs> speak of the devil. I'll need to take a very long nap after this. Activate the defense mechanisms! I'm so invested. I'm so sorry, guys. Look at us. We're so badass. Look at Rover. I have to kill them first. Thank you. Some of us are still fighting you there. We must go help them. Speeding up. Dangerous here. Let's head back first. Uh, please tell me this is the last one. Rover, your moves are sharp as always. Dealing with so many TDs seem like a walk in the park for you. Practice makes perfect. <laughs> Rover. Did you see that? No, it's the moon. Oh, it's blurry. Now it's almost identical to what we saw three years ago during the battle beneath the crescent. It's only been three years. That makes sense. We're already running out of time. Don't worry, I will. Report this 
situation, please? Madam Magistrate, the barrier has been fully repaired, and we have evacuated all residents. We've successfully minimized the damage. Well done, Director Tauchi. Long time no see. Indeed. It's been a while, Rover. It's been going according to plan, if I may say so. I was made aware of this in advance, and planned out our defense beforehand. Was it another hint from, like, Jue? Now that we are facing such an emergency, I cannot sit back and wait for Jue to save us. I will act and see my duty through. This is my decision. I have secured some much-needed aid for our city during my visit to the capital. Also, our experts should be ready by now. Rover, do you still remember Jue's message for you? No. Now we have raindrops that fall upstream, and the Midnight Rangers General and the Norfolk Barons, ready to take on the Overthrax. This must be the right time Julie was talking about. Rover, it's going to be dangerous. You might directly confront a Threnodian. I'll eat it with my hand. I'm ready to go. Your eyes look as determined as ever. You will be remembered as a heroic ally in our defense against external threats, regardless of the outcome of this battle. May victory prevail the lasting night. I will pray for your safe return. I'll eat it. Don't worry. I have informed border checkpoints across Jinjiao about your trip to the front line. You have been granted unlimited access to all places. Yang Yang, you're one of our outriders. I hope you can go with Rover and provide assistance. No! You'll need to pass through a tacit field to reach our base in the Desert Rock Highland. Please, be careful. Rover, Yang Yang, I'll be keeping the city safe as a patroller. Do come back in one piece, okay? Will do. Thanks. I'll give it my all. It seems the rain is not stopping anytime soon. The city. What if... Rest assured, you can count on me. I will keep everyone safe. M me too. Don't forget us, Lion Dance Troop! We got this! <laughs> As you can see, everyone's ready to defend our city. How cute! Rover, Yang Yang, safe travels! I've informed General Jian that you're heading to his place. He will be meeting up with you soon. May victory prevail the lasting night! Okay, Amber, but with guns. Oh? Defend the south gate! Enemy attack weakening! This wave is almost over. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Finale. All tacit discords nearby have been dealt with. 
Now the city's defense. Okay. Please update me on the situation in Jinjo City. Under Madam Magistrate's command, the barrier has been activated and citizens are being evacuated to the safe zone. Washu Academy and Ministry of Development are on standby for further instructions. Uh -huh. The Baiju is overseeing operations at the Academy while Mortafi has arrived at the Ministry. Rest assured, we are all safe in the city. And the rover, she is heading over to meet you. Yang Yang is coming with her. I see. We have successfully contained the outbreak here at the base. What? I will go pick them up as soon as possible. Yes. The rain's getting heavier. There are signs of tacit discords reviving. Intense frequency fluctuations detected. They'll be passing through that area. I must create a safe passage for them. I need to clear the way for them as quickly as possible. Are you forgetting I'm here to kick ass? A couple more tacit discords here. What's a thundering Memphis? You mean the birds? Revival has done significant damage to the environment nearby. Things have gotten even more dangerous out here. The closer we get to Norfolk Barrens, the worse it gets. Oh no! The streams feel heavy with dread and the smell of blood. There must be a brutal fight going down in the Deserok Island. The tacit field directed Tao Chi mentioned should be right up ahead. We but like it's pretty. To Look at the moon. And find General Jian. I wonder what other anomalies await us ahead. Is that one of our soldiers? Those soldiers, they were found in some more tacit discords. Be careful. Swift and resolute. One is the sound. Murder. Brain's effects are worsening. We must proceed with caution. Okay. Then, another wounded soldier. Oh, shoot. Howdy, homie. Are you. Are you Yang Yang? Oh, thank goodness. What happened here? The thundering Mephis. It came back. I'm. I'm part of the Deso Rock Highland Supply Transport Team. This is where our supply station is. We work to keep our soldiers alive. We were on our way. Had to go through this tacit field. Thundering Mephis. The rain brought it back to life. Crushing our transport. In the end, I barely escaped. I 
can't move anymore. Damn, that sucks. It's dangerous. Careful. Please. You don't understand who I am. Okay, in another lifetime, they used to call me the galactic baseballer. It's him. General... Thundering Mephis. We must bring it down to keep pushing forward. Okay, Trailblazer, relax. This is a blend of countless fallen soldiers' reverberations. As long as more soldiers are still dying here, it will always return. Not to mention, countless souls of our brave soldiers remain trapped in this rain to this day. General. Sorry. I should have arrived sooner. I whooped its ass. I think I've seen you before. Is that so? You're a mysterious individual with vast experience. If we had crossed paths before, I wouldn't be surprised. Madam Magistrate and Tao Chi have informed me of your willingness to assist us. Thank you for lending us a hand. Yeah, no problem. I properly welcome you with Huang Long's formalities, but as the current situation forbids that, I'll brief you on our plans as fast as possible. What am I in this game? You know, like in in Honkai Star Realm, the Galactic Baseballer, aka the Trailblazer. But like, what what's my goofy what's what's my goofy little little name here? I've heard about your deeds from Madam Magistrate. You are a trustworthy ally, according to her. Here, Retroact Rain Antidote, developed by the Academy. While the antidote cannot shield you from its effects entirely, it should at least lessen the hallucinations. What if I was a phantom then? For someone to show up as a phantom in the retroact rain, two conditions must be met. Prior a basic ass rover. No. You were found in the gorges of spirits only recently. And this is your first time setting foot in Jinjo, ruling out that possibility. Moreover, you possess a similar ability with the legendary hero who once absorbed Thrunodian. Jue prophesied about your arrival. I was told you'd come to the Norfall Barrens one day to reclaim your lost power from Overthrax. I'll do everything in my power to help you make that happen. reclaim my lost power yes madam magistrate might not be aware of this as it happened before she was appointed on the day i was selected to be the next general jue told me this beneath the full moon guide the returning one to confront thranodian from the threat itself he shall reclaim the power to conquer it and if you are indeed the returning one mentioned here, 
we may actually get rid of that monster once and for all. You might have noticed something off about that moon. We call it the Void Plenilune. Yeah, I don't know what a Plenilune is. Once it takes shape, Overthrax, the Thranodian of War, would be reawakening soon. Yes. It is an ancient terror that reigns over our land, capable of devouring weapon frequencies to enhance itself. The Northfall Barons have become a massive graveyard of weapons after countless battles. Those weapons would have made it even stronger than before. Yes. But we must act now. The Void Plenilune is already visible. We must contain the Thranodian swiftly. Any delay could allow it to recover and become harder to deal with. <laughs> Any suggestions for music at my funeral? Okay, I'm at it. Hold on. We cannot afford to rush the plan. You don't understand how much of a badass I am. I've taken care of all the tacit discords nearby on my way here. The path ahead should be relatively safe now. Keep going and we'll reach the base soon. I don't have to fight them, I could just... Wait, is that...? Is... is that...? Is... oh, Is that the Thornodian? Thrax's towering statue, built oh. from repurposed weapons and debris, has long loomed over Jinjo as a foreboding symbol of our ongoing struggle. We managed to gravely injure it three years ago, making the statue sink into the water. And now it just resurfaced. Our enemy must be eager to strike. The Damn. The base is right up ahead. Let's hurry over. Greetings, General. Master Tianxing? Didn't know I'd be seeing you here. Jianxin recently arrived at our base with one of the supply delivery teams. She has been a great help. <sighs> General, you flatter me. I've heard people comparing the Norfolk Barons to a massive graveyard. Whenever it rains, Cries and moans can be heard as if many ghosts are weeping. Master once told me, life and death should follow a natural course. The heavens and the earth form a vast chamber where spirits freely depart and return. Countless brave souls have been trapped here by the evil powers of Overthrax. I want to help set them free. Okay, but like, why I... Now, maybe they just do this to, like, move, like, the, like, story along and to make it obvious. But, like, why... Why does everyone who has the, the wave, uh, the symbol, uh, thing, they have to, like, show it off? Like... Like, cool, cool design, but, like, why... Please follow me. Like, our main goal is to contain the reviving Thronodian, but we must be like, it has to be like open. Too. They have shown unpredictability in every past battle. The Academy determined they were not native to the Norfall Barons and instead had been conjured by a mysterious power. After analyzing their behavior, 
I believe the source of said power is none other than that statue. While the Overthrax is still weakened, we must seize the opportunity to act. With looming danger from the continued onsets of TD outbreaks and many of our units injured and unable to fight, it is crucial to plan our attack wisely. Please, join me in mapping out the strategic plans. Like, even with Rover, like... Like the glove, you know? I don't know, man. I ask too many questions. I have split all combat units into three factions. The ranged units team will provide fire support from afar, while the infantry team engages in close combat. Lastly, we have maybe it's the law. Over Yang Yang, Jianxin, and me. Allow me to introduce Kong Lin, leader of the ranged units team. And this is Yue Hui. He's in charge of the infantry team. This is a topographical map of the Norfall Barrens. The Overthrax's power limits our reach. Outriders Do you get to pick where it is, Barrens, you know? Like, like a... Like a whole thing? Or are you just kind of like born and you got this like tattoo ago, on you? We discovered the suspended ruins in its hinterland. But the terrain is treacherous, narrow and flanked by high cliffs on both sides, leaving only one path for our troops to travel. On the other hand, our enemies must take the same route if they want to attack us. With the Overthrax reorganizing their frequencies and bringing them back, we will face endless waves of attacks. Every time we cut down an enemy, it gains more power. Bro, what if you got it on your butt cheek though? Or worse! Time is of the essence. We cannot afford a prolonged battle. We must swiftly and safely get our strongest units in the heart of the battlefield, reach that statue, and take down Overthrax in time. Let me at him! Come on now. Like, you're, you're sitting there, just... Let's plan carefully and use each team's strength to our advantage. I will murder him! And then eat him with my hand. First, our ranged units. Armed with long-range weapons, they can strike from a distance. But we need to strategize based on the terrain, topography, and enemy forces. If we maneuver Oof, yeah. to our advantage, our strikes will be more effective and cover a larger range. Where should we deploy the ranged units? I don't care. Put me in. Sure, I don't. Mixing ranged and infantry units may seem versatile, but it wastes the advantage of ranged units. <sighs> this may not be the best strategy. Where should we deploy the ranged units? Oh, I actually had to I actually had to pick. Deploying our ranged units high above the valleys in advance. This way, they'll provide cover for our close combat forces while staying safe themselves. I thought he would just be like, their range advantage to the fullest. You're the general! Hard move. Next, the infantry. They have been trained and equipped for close combat. The heart of Norfall Valley is our main battleground, where we'll fight our enemies head on. We need to plan our attack wisely. How should the infantry engage enemy targets? Close! Now that the narrow terrain has dictated an inevitable confrontation, the infantry will attack head on, breaking their line. Then our task force can strike where they're vulnerable. A reasonable choice.
Lastly, the Special Task Force. All Resonators with powerful abilities, they have superior mobility and combat skills. If the chance arises, they will be responsible for taking down the Overthrax. What should the Special Task Force do? We'll join our effort to break through their defenses and crush their source of power. This is the only way to completely rout the enemies. It's a risky but necessary move under our current circumstances. Thank you, Rover. The battle plan is clear. I will now recap our plan. Okay. Kong Lin, your team will take the cliffs for fire support. Yuehui, your team will charge enemy lines to pave way for the special task force. Yes, sir. And I'll I don't know why I had to tell you that. Yang and Jian Shin to create an opening for our main forces and take down the Thrinodian. I am the main forces. clear on what to do our next move is to reclaim the disruptor and break through the ground wave barrier <gasps> not the EPs. more unfamiliar terms you see that iridescent veil yeah that's the ground wave barrier overthrax set it up to absorb frequencies in the norfall barons without interruption one of our top priorities now is to protect the disruptor from tacit discord attacks it's a powerful anti thrinodian weapon from when Jinjo was founded. We need it to break through this barrier. Okay. I'll leave it to the professional to explain the details. Okay. Greetings, General Jian. Rover. How's the preparation going on your side? We've got good news and bad news. Good news is we've established connection to the disruptor and we're ready to go. Bad news is the disruptor's electric capacitor is damaged. Yes. Okay. Simply put, it's out of power. Fortunately, <laughs> the look of like really. <laughs> to use the disruptor, we'll have to repair that outlet first, mm -hmm. then wait for a full charge. Okay. Is that going to take like an hour? I don't have any more questions. This is a weapon of mass destruction. The capital would want strict control over its use, I assume. Will they really approve our application? The magistrate and I have it covered. Trust me. All right. We'll be waiting for the green light. Lastly, we've got more bad news. Baija, please fill us in. Yes. Rover, I am currently monitoring the tacit discord attacks from the Academy to design a safer route for you. We just received word from our soldiers at the emplacement. A large number of tacit discords are targeting the disruptor, and our troops are doing their best to defend it. The disruptor has been surrounded by the tacit discords, with more of them slowly closing in. Yes. After we recapture the nearby emplacement, it will take some more time for the disruptor to recharge. You may need to hold out a little longer. That's okay. Can you I'll just... The coordinates of the Bitch, I will the fight them all. Wish you the best of luck. I trust we all understand the situation now. I've been We're understanding to a degree. Secure the disruptor and fix its backup energy outlet. John Shin, please stay and guard the base. I'll draw those tacit discords away. Let's get moving. Be a good woolly now.
Ui. Hello. You must be Hi, I'm Yang Yang, an outrider. General Jian sent us here to help. How are things going? Those monsters have occupied the emplacement with a surprise attack, but a few brave troops are still holding on. We've blocked off access to protect our base, but I'm opening it up for you. Please, they need your help. We're counting on you. It is natural to feel dreadful if you succeed. Yippee! The tacit discords are everywhere. We've cornered a soldier. Over there. He needs our help. Oh shit. I press right click, man. But yeah, is that so great? We know how important this cannon is. We kept it safe, never let them have it. He did. Damn, hers is on her forehead. That must suck. You you probably got bullied for that. Nice. Reparation key. Take it. Oh, he's not dead yet. I may not see our victory in person. But please. Please defeat that monster. For us. You are a brave warrior. Thank you. He dead. Aw. Yang Yang, it's okay. Yes. We will win. Please. Rest in peace. Oh, here, I, I guess I can... Do the one in the corner, man. Really, let let me off. 
Jeez. <laughs> I like how like the battle music just like stopped now because I took so long. <laughs> it's not my fault. They all fell off the cliff. Stairs, whatever. Oh, hi. Well done. The rain has stopped. General, the retroact rain's effects are subsiding. We are observing a sharp decline in the number of TDs in the Norfall Barrens. The disruptor is fully charged and ready to fire, but... It takes a lot of energy to fire the disruptor. If we missed... This is our only chance. The rain stopped though, like we chilling, right? As the Magistrate of Jinjo, I've obtained the approval to use the Disruptor in combat. The enormous energy consumption, the risk of a misfire, and the weight of this decision... I will bear the responsibility. I alone will be accountable for the outcome of this battle. Whatever it may be. General, Rover, please march on. May victory prevail the lasting night. I pray for your safe return. Thank you for your trust, Madam Magistrate. No need for that, General. We've always shared the same goal, you and I. Yeah, we got dragons. Intentional units. Do everything you can to assist. You are authorized to use the disruptor. Target the Norfall Barons. Defend Jinjo at all costs! Cool. Let me in. Oh damn, bitch. Fighting a bear. We'll shake them off. Use your grapple now.
Master Tianxing. There's too many of them. Someone must stay behind to keep them at bay. Everyone, let's part ways here. Carry on with your mission. You can leave the rest to me. Is this what's gonna happen? We're just gonna keep going down this path and people are gonna stay behind as, as we continue. Also, so sorry about the ads. Follow me. We're going down from here. Mind the cliff. Rover, are you all right? Stay sharp. I'm chilling. Beacon here is still functioning, and the defense feature is intact, too. We can catch our breath here. The Overthrax assault has been as brutal as expected. We've been cut off from our main forces. It's the three of us against all of them from here. Master Tianxing, I hope she's okay. I tried to contact her and our base, but nothing came back. The Thronodian's power is possibly interfering with terminal signals. We have no choice but to trust them now. Let's press on. We're bound to face a vicious fight. We've reached the suspended ruins. We'll get going once you're ready. Okay. Unusually quiet this wall. We should be able to clear the way with our grapple. What? Every path ahead has been cut off. Yes. We're not seeing anything at the moment. Rover, be careful. Something bigger might be waiting for us ahead. Oh, really? Wow. Ready for battle. Fear no more. Tell truth from the song. Swift and resolute. One the sound. There we go. As expected, the enemies are increasingly strong as we approach the statue. Uh, it was like control? the enemies we fought yeah. back there, to be honest. I'm okay, but Rover, he. I'm fine. Battle has left you with a few scratches. Oh no! Some first aid with me. Please use them. The upcoming battles will be even more dangerous. Should you get injured, you must let me know in time. Let's keep moving. Oh, I'm I'm dumb. Don't mind me. Hold on. There are several floating platforms ahead. Perhaps Brother, make use of them. I thought. Yeah, I thought I'd.
got it. Oh, that scene. We'll need to get rid of them. Her dialogue, whatever. Finally. Rover, you hear me? Yes. Our signals got blocked off by the Thronodian's power. It took us a lot of effort to make this call get through. Okay. I have to say, your terminal has a very intriguing design. We'd love to thoroughly investigate it once we have the chance. Okay. Business. We are aware of your situation. Luckily, your current location is still within the disruptor's range. We can provide fire support. You've seen what the disruptor is capable of. We can turn down the output power, but I strongly advise finding cover far away. The structure of this building is almost entirely destroyed. We'll need to create a safe space where we can take cover. Yes. There is a floating platform over there. Perhaps we can make use of it. Aim at that wall. We can pull ourselves over. Yo, a chest. Mortify, it's time. Understood. Watch out, everyone. We did it. The disruptor's power is down to one third. We can only fire it one more time. After that, it needs to recharge. Take care, everyone. I'm on standby to help you anytime. Okay. Let's try pulling the floating boulders together. We should make our path ahead. One moment, Rover. We can work the terrain to our advantage here. Let's try to pull that wall down on them, and they'll be trapped underneath. Well done. Yippee. Same situation. Let's do it again. Now we're just cheating. An impermanence I could have been doing that the whole time. Just let me fight you. You're wide open. Tell truth on the side. Wind rider. Come down here. along the way i couldn't have made it past them so fast without you i know i'm pretty great almost there the statue's power is oh stronger. thank you well, thank you we don't have much time left let's move on oh my god Oh my god! Oh my god! It sent me flying! It sent me flying! It sent me flying! I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Stop it! There are more 
the floor is up there. But how are we going to climb up? We won't. see a gravity stream ahead. It's currently blocked off. We'll pull the rocks away first. I'm already on there. it. Almost reached the top. That giant rock. We've got to move. It moved a little. Let's almost there. <sighs> we finally did it. We will reach the top soon. is completely blocked off you choose where the disruptors last blast hits make it count rover you're the general with like some dragon so thing and force. This amount of enemies, we cannot fire the disruptor again. Yang Yang, you. The Trinodian is only going to summon more of them as we go. We need someone to keep them away and escort the others into the statue. I understand you're planning to do it yourself, General. But I think I am better suited for this task. Okay. Goodbye. Have fun. We all want to beat the Pernodian once and for all. I understand that you don't want to leave anyone behind. But we all know you and Rover have the best chance against that monster. Facts? Now that our shared goal is within hand's reach, I... I do not want to let it slip away. Indeed, Yang Yang. Turns out I was the one being indecisive. I see. Now, Rover. Please make the call. Stand guard here. The Thrinodian will not be able to draw more power from the monsters. I'll leave the rest to you. You're speaking in lowercase. I'll leave the rest to you. Oh. Right there. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh -huh. It seems the culprit is hidden deep within this statue. This will be our final battle with this Renodian. 
Rover, are you ready? Ready to kick some Thernodian arse. <laughs> That's the spirit. Let's bring an end to this war once and for all. Bro, did I have a choice to not go through that? In the story? Like, okay. It's fine. That's another moon. What on earth is happening? The crownless. The Threnodian has reconstructed its frequencies. The Threnodian. That moon has cannibalized the crownless's remaining frequencies to create another monster. I remember I saw it during the battle beneath the crescent. Let me grab it. Watch out for its ranged attacks. Oh, okay. What do you noticed? It avoids attacking the moon behind. That moon must be the core of our enemy. This thing is weakening. I'll shield you from its attacks. Rover, find a chance to strike its core.
fight me. Yeah, so like it still does not make sense how I got that. I'm dumb. Hit you. Bad timing. One more time. You're wide open. Like the time. Set. Tell truth from the sun. Treat to advance. Fight back. Oh my god, you're you're fucking me up. Yeah, so, um, how 
did I unlock Havoc powers? Because it really doesn't make sense. But I didn't even do the hand suck. I was just reaching out to the bitch. Is that the thing in my hand that's like so hungry? Must eat. Food. I want food. Oh my god, it is. <laughs> what? As the conceptualization of war somehow it opted to flee instead of fighting us properly this seemed weak rover is that this place is collapsing soon let's get out of here first All right. Wouldn't hurt to be more prepared. Gather round. I have a tale to spin. Uh. A feather-haired maiden faces a horde of beasts, and just in time, a ray of light. Sunbeams burst through the clouds, banishing darkness out of sight. From the statue emerged to guess who we have? None other than General Jian and the legendary rover. And lo, ruins fell, a colossus shattered, the Overthrax meets its defeat. Mountains and rivers exulted in glee as the war's finale came to be. As they say, why fear when fate is ours to shape? Amidst setbacks, heroes will rise to conquer. Their determination fuels the fire of hope in our darkest hour. Under starlit skies, we battled divine rune roaring above. Now victorious, our songs of triumph shall shake the clouds. And our story goes on. I mean, okay. Lit. So like... What? <laughs> How, how do I? Oh. She's so cute.
This power, it's mysterious, yet reassuring nonetheless. Yet reassuring nonetheless. Reach. Just, yeah. I want to max your level out first, Missy. There we go, and then I can put the rest into you. I will get you up. I will get you up, Rover. Don't you worry. Well, guys! That was fucking cool! That was cool indeed. Very cool. Very cool. Much wow. We're gonna do some more pulls real quick. We got three more pulls. On the weapon. Skip. Do another. I got a purple. I'll let it go through. Lunar Cutter. Lit. The last one for now. Another blue. We skip. It's okay. It's fine. I'm only like, what? Fifteen pulls in, like I, you know, like oh, I don't think I'm gonna begin that anytime soon. <laughs> but I obviously have a ton of more quests to go through, side quests, little companion quests. Uh, I have a ton of these like event things to go through and farm out, as well as farming stuff. Or yes, I did that. Farming stuff for the characters and everything else. Um, so I'm I'm definitely not done playing this. I'm definitely not done playing this, guys. I never will be. I'm hooked. I'm addicted to this game. Yo, did you just give me more things? No. <laughs> but yeah, guys. Yeah, uh, that that's kind of what I mean. I haven't touched it at all. I haven't touched it at all. So that is definitely what I'm going to be doing later. Not later today, but later in date. Um, I I know it's super quick, but I have to go. I have to go, guys. I, I haven't had anything to eat yet today. Uh, I kind of woke up right before stream. Uh, so. Be a good woolly now. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to move over here. We are going to go ahead and close down the game for now. I was a little late to stream, too. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I suck. I suck. <laughs> uh, let's see, let's see. Who are we going to raid? I really do appreciate you guys being here with me, though, throughout the, you know, story. I really do appreciate that. Um, go to Withering Waves. Withering Waves. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh my goodness. Let's just go ahead and raid this one. They're they're super duper cute. I'm not brother offline. What? I just what? <laughs> okay, sorry. Hold on. Change of plans. Change of plans. Hold on.
Oh, ma, 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 ma. We're gonna we're gonna rate this person. You're already late to ASMR. No, I'm not. It's seven oh seven. ASMR's at eight. I will be late. I won't lie. I will 100% be late. I will 100% be late, and I'm sorry. <laughs> But uh, I, I am going to go eat food. Here, let's turn on the lo-fi. I hate not having music. It makes me feel so empty-brained. Let's just read this person's. They look like they know what they're doing. <laughs> but yes, guys, uh, if anyone is new here and you haven't followed me yet, now is the perfect time to do so. I do stream every single day. I'm super duper variety. I do all kinds of stuff. I, I will be doing ASMR later. Uh, it may be a bit late. It's supposed to start at 8, but I'm going to go grab some food and get everything set up and eat. Uh, and then I will be doing ASMR. Uh, if anything does happen and I can't do it, I will be letting my Discord server know. So go ahead and join the Discord server through that link there, okay? Uh, you can get notified for when I go live, when I post on Twitter, TikTok, YouTube, all of that stuff. We have weekly community events. Tomorrow we are watching episodes five through eight of Free Rent. Uh, so, you know, I'm, I'm excited for that. I really, I'm really liking it so far. I haven't seen it yet. I'm watching it with you guys. Uh, also, go ahead and check out all my socials through that link there. Uh, that has my Patreon, Twitter, Discord, TikTok, all of it, my donation links, anything that is officially mine, you can find through that link there. And of course, if you would like to support me in any way, shape, or form, you, you being here chatting, following, lurking means oh so super duper very much to me. It really does. Uh... You can also sub or use your free Amazon Prime sub on little old me. You get ad free viewing, tons of super duper cute emotes to use across all of Twitch and uh, special roles in that Discord server as well if you connect the two. If you would like to support me further than that, you can donate to me through that link there. All that money goes directly towards me. It helps me fund things like the new model, microphone upgrades, stuff for ASMR, games to play on stream, etc, etc. It does help me out, never at all required. Uh, you can also check out the wish list, same thing, but more direct. Uh, and it does help me out. I am a super duper small streamer and it is my full time job. <laughs> But regardless of that, if you would like to add me on Wuwa, I don't really know how the whole thing works there, but there is my uh, UID. And uh, yeah, thank you all for being here today. I love you all super duper very much. Uh, there is the raid message for you all. Please go give them tons of love and support. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go grab food. Don't know what yet, but I'm going to go grab food and... Thank you all. Thank you all for being here. Uh, I don't know when I'm going to be playing Withering Waves again. I don't know my schedule. Ah! Uh, it's next week. Next week. So I, I have to make the schedule still. Uh, but yeah. <laughs> uh, you can find my schedule on the Discord, on Twitter, on Twitch itself in the schedule tab. But anyway, I hope you all have a good night if I don't see you later. And yeah. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.